In this video, we'll take a look at OpsGenie Actions, an easy way to automate manual tasks from the OpsGenie console or mobile app. Teams can define scripts or run actions from third-party applications, empowering them to rapidly investigate and resolve alerts. Let's walk through an example. The platform team wants to restart an EC2 instance from inside OpsGenie with a prompt to the on-call engineer. Begin by creating an action channel from the Actions tab within your team dashboard. Click the Add Action Channel button name your channel, and select the type. There are two supported channel types, AWS Systems Manager, where you can execute any AWS automation document, or REST Input, a flexible way to integrate a variety of automation tools. Select AWS Systems Manager, enter your AWS account ID, region, and provide a name for the AWS role field. Click the blue box. Optioning creates an AWS CloudFormation template. Add a stack name, click the checkbox, and the Create button. Navigate back to OpsGenie and click Create. Your action channel is now connected to your AWS account. Next, select Add Action from the action screen. Enter a name, select AWS Systems Manager for the type, and select the action channel that you created in the previous step. The Systems Manager dropdown will populate with available documents. Choose AWS Start EC2 Instance. Under Manage Permissions, you can give the entire team access to trigger an action, or you can specify individual team members. The Enable Action Policies button is selected by default. This allows OpsGenie to execute the action automatically. However, in our example, the team wants more control and to be prompted prior to the restart of the EC2 instance. So we'll uncheck the radio button and click Next. Here you will define the parameters that will be passed from OpsGenie to Systems Manager. Instance ID is a required field for this action and the team wants it to be predefined on alert creation. You can enter manual values or set up a dynamic field using curly braces. In this example, we're telling OpsGenie to display the instance ID in the alert description field. For automation assume role, we want to be prompted at runtime. So we'll choose prompt user from the dropdown, select dropdown list for the input type, enter the ARN values, and click update and create. The final step is to decide which alert should display the action when clicked on in OpsGenie. Navigate to your CloudWatch integration and add the instance ID to the description field and the action name to the Actions field. Click Save Integration, your OpsGenie action setup is complete. Now let's see how it works on the desktop and the mobile app. Our CloudWatch integration has triggered an alert that an EC2 instance has stopped running. Select the alert and the dropdown will show the EC2 automation trigger that you defined during setup. Select Start EC2 with Prompt. The instance ID you predefined during setup is shown. Choose the proper ARN from the dropdown field and click Execute. After an automation document has run, OpsGenie will query AWS for the result and display it in the alert activity log, confirming its status for you. Additionally, a new alert confirming that EC2 instance is running is created. If you know that you always want to restart a stopped EC2 instance, you can run the action automatically upon alert creation via an action policy. From the team page, select Policies, scroll to the bottom and click Add Action Policy. Provide a policy name, a description, and click Enable Policy. From the dropdown, select Match All Conditions below and Add Stopped from the Message field. Then click Add New Condition and select Source Contains CloudWatch Events. In the Execute and Action field, select Start EC2 Instance and click Create and Enable Policy. To test that the action is working, navigate to EC2 and manually stop an instance. Now go back to the Opsgenie Alerts dashboard where you will see an alert for the stopped instance and an alert that the EC2 instance has been restarted automatically. Begin automating your own scripts today. Start a free 14-day trial of OpsGene.